Hello guys, welcome. This is wait what? <laughs> Hello guys, Zach Wolf here, and today, um, the only reason why I'm showing you a PS Vita video right now is because people are having trouble with this problem, which is called the blue light of death on their PS Vita fat models. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how to fix that. So basically, you just put your PS Vita in sleep mode, which some people do. Um, and then it does this. Give it a minute. Any minute now. There it goes. It does that, but it just keeps on blinking and it doesn't shut off. Well, mine does that because, you know, I don't have the blue light of death. Anywho, um, to basically fix that, you got to hold down the power button. Where is my flashlight? I will have to show you. Give me a minute. Oy. There we go. Oh, that's my hot dogs, by the way. <sighs> Anyways, um, oy, 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 oy. okay. So you're supposed to hold down this power button right there. I don't know if this thing will focus on it. Focus. No. Yeah, the power button right there. And then, basically, after you see the power light stop blinking, like, hold on, like that, if you see it stop blinking, let's do that. Basically, what you do now, to fix the blue light of death, you press, oops, oof, you gotta go in safe mode, of course, oh, look at that, that's a cool looking effect. Yes, yeah, it's got fingerprints and stuff on the delivery, because uh, I use it a lot. Anyways. You go here to the power button right here, and then you press this, um, R, you press R1, and then you press the PlayStation button right here. Um, R -G -L -R -L -R. oh, what? Okay, let me give you a little demo. I'll just set you guys right there. So basically, power button, R1 button, and then the PS button. So you press all three of these. As you can see, the thing starts up, and then there you go. It should go to the safe mode thing. And with safe mode, you can't use the touch screen or anything. You got to use the uh, D pad right here because you can't also use the joystick. You got to use the D pad. So basically, what you do to fix the blue light of death, you basically just go to here or rebuild database if you want to. You can just go to here to restart the system. Just press X. And then it should shut itself off and turn it back on. And then this should happen. And then your little blue light of death problem should be fixed. And then it should go to the menu screen right here. Just peel that off. And yes, I got a picture of Nick. And then it should read your game like this. And then boom, you should be good. And then you can go back to playing like uh, Mortal Kombat or whatever, or like go back to playing like Mortal Kombat or whatever. But yeah, guys, that is basically how you fix the blue light of death on your PS Vita. If that, if this video helped you, give this a big giant like, a thumbs up right there, big old thumbs up. And yeah, guys, and then maybe if this helped, then you can go back to gaming on your PS Vita without the wretched blue light of death. So it should basically just fix the blue light of death entirely. So yeah, like I said, now that's fixed and everything. Like I said, you can rebuild the database just in case. But if you just press restart the system, it should just work just fine. And then you should be, be able to go back to playing Mortal Kombat or maybe Need for Speed or whatever you like. And uh, yeah. So this is Zach Wolf and I'm out. Peace. Nick is life.